I've never been more sincere. First time I ever stood in front of somebody and demanded attention. Listen to me. Listen to me. Hell is real. It's as real as we're sitting here. You know, God turns back. I've heard this said to me. And there's a war being waged for our souls. I was laying in that hospital room, and I'm hearing this conversation. It's like somebody bartering for my soul. And I kept saying things to Arthur. What's going on, you know? This and that, and I done woke up. I'm like hearing these voices in my head that's, you know, well, he ain't worth all that. Look what he's done. Like fighting going on. But she wasn't hearing nothing. And I'm tripping out. You know, we had a long talk, you know, last night about this. And she's reminded, you know, tell me some things that's going on. And, I, you know, there's so much to that seven days of being unconscious that you don't, you can't put it in perspective. And we ain't got enough time to hear it all. But the bottom line is, I'm real. This is the real deal. I'm not here trying to slip in. I was trying to slip in. I was trying to slip in just like I did that day. But that don't work like that. It don't work like that at all. All I can tell you is, hell is real. So is God. So is Jesus. And if I need this, I need 51 years ago, when I hit the floor running, I would have lived like this because there's no other way. How you do? There's no other way to live. There's no other way to live. There's no other way to live. It's hard to be bad. It's easy to be good. It's God's grace that does it. 100%. And, and all the things that's, that's happened in my life, the, the word luck, Okay? Like I was trying to explain, I, I don't believe in gambling. Look, you ain't gonna keep me to put my money in the machine that pays 11%. I don't want to tell you, I'm just a numbers guy, you know? But the fact is, I don't bet on nothing unless it's a sure thing. I don't bet on nothing unless it's a sure thing. I put all my heart and soul on Jesus Christ. But you know what I'm saying? You're gonna win, because that's what Jesus did. He's going Caleb, let me say this. Yeah, let's say, Caleb, last night, you know, I don't know what to say. Build a fire. He built a fire in me. He built a fire in me. We got things happening in this church just amazing. All right, y'all, I'm sorry.